video action. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another video, otro video. So finally, I bring to you guys a video that's not a vlog. Um, and I have posted about this on my Instagram weeks ago where I just asked like, oh, would you guys be interested in me doing a video where I just show you some of my favorite cute things I own? Because if you know me in person or even if you just follow me on Instagram, then you know I have a thing for cute things. Whatever it is, a bag, stationery, clothes jewelry anything i just love cute things cute things make me so happy especially if they're like colorful i mean maybe if you see in the background there's like you just know my aesthetic my essence um so i wanted to do a video just showing you guys some of the cute things just if you like cute things or if you just want to watch this and have it in the background as you get ready and i'll try my best to say where all these things are from even though you know obviously most of these things i've bought here in korea but still or maybe you can get inspiration on buying cute things too and let's just be cute thing lovers hope you guys enjoy this video let's get on into it okay so the first thing i'm going to show you is a plushie because this is like my recent purchase and i think it's my favorite like character right now sorry ryan but it is ryan's pet chonsik <laughs> Yes, I am a 23-year-old woman. This period, I mean, doesn't matter how old you are. I was telling my parents today on call, like, they were like, oh, mija, todavía eres una niña chiquita con tus cosas. And I'm like, <laughs> I'm not the only one. All of my other friends I have here also get excited when we see cute things. But anyways, this is Chunsik. He is Cacao Friends Ryan, Ryan's pet, which the cutest thing ever anyway so i believe this is like a little like shorts like for shower i'm not sure but when i saw this for the first time on the cacao friend store i was just like <laughs> oh you're gonna go home with me right but the first time i saw it in the cacao, cacao friend store i was like <clears throat> no i'm not gonna buy it i'm gonna be smart even though i had the money um but this time i went to hongdae and i was like you're going home with me oh, look how cute so this one it has its hand in its pockets if you take it off you know but this is how it's supposed to be like his hand in the short yeah it's so cute so this is my favorite plushie right now i love it to pieces and i definitely i'm gonna buy more chunsik things now i want a keychain but yeah this is Junsik and you can get a cacao cacao sponsor me eh? since we're on the cacao talk uh see what i did there okay so i'm just gonna show you two keychains of ryan that i just think are so cute so i got these both obviously in cacao friends so this one is like a lemon ryan which look how cute he's just in there and then this one is just a toast um with a little mini toast here these are so cute i tend to use this one more but now that spring is coming up like i feel like this would be really really nice i do want to find a strawberry ryan I haven't seen that though but anyways these are other two cute things next let me show you this cute piggy bank and i got this at daiso and it's just you know from winnie the pooh look how cute and it's right here so i had to buy it and i mean there's nothing else to say about it it's just really cute i feel like everyone has to own a cute uh, piggy bank because it is cute you just put your coins in there and yes next thing is this pencil case which i also got at daiso so it's just like this banana milk carton thing it is so cute and every time i go to daiso i want to buy more pencil cases but like i already have one <sighs> and this one's so cute i just love it so much so obviously all my things in there so yeah this is so cute those have like a chocolate one but um i just love the yellow next is this cute notebook which oh uh, i was looking for one of these kind of notebooks that have like little clear 
what is this cover and like open and close because i wanted to get like a sticker notebook where i just basically put all my stickers and kind of just decorate and stuff i i'm trying to get into sticker journaling and stuff i just need to get more creative with it because right now i've just been doing basic things but this one i got it at a bookstore i forgot where if i remember i'll put it right here but you know you can see this in your typical stationary cute things and yes i got it here in korea so <clears throat> i it, it's actually like a planner but you know i was like you know what i'm just gonna use it as like layouts for stickers and then in the back it has a little bag and i keep my little stickers in here and this is just oh, so cute like next is this airpod case which i bought recently in a store in hongdae so it's this care bear oh does it look like my head hello <laughs> so it's this purple care bear and it just has this little thing for you on the go <laughs> just to have on the go like hey what's up and then i also wanted to show you this cute little pouch that i got at daiso what even is this is this like a cat i think so but this is perfect for like coins or airpod case in there so uh, next thing is i want to show you guys a character that i like so it's pico 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 i hope i'm saying it right so i have this little notebook which i actually hadn't written on it yeah see the thing is i see a bunch of notebooks and i like but i don't use like this one i'm just like oh it's so cute for decoration but also i need to write on it but i just need to get back into journaling like I, back home, I have like a bunch of journals, one for different things, like one is for my thoughts, one is for my like daily thoughts, one is for like deep, deep thoughts, like you get me, and another one is for like dreams and goals, and then I had like a dream journal, but anyways, I have this cute notebook, I got it at Daiso, pretty, pretty cute, and then I also have this bag, which I also got at Daiso, and this just says, Pico, have a great day with Pico, look how cute yeah before going home i need to like buy a bunch of this cute pico things because it's just it's so cute let me show you another notebook which is this cute mang notebook which i actually got this when i was studying abroad here um in line friends and it's i just love this notebook because it's like the like it's not a hardcover i don't know how to describe it but that's what makes it cute and it's like a little bubblegum mang so ugh, so cute so this is actually my diary i don't know why i, I hesitated in saying that it's not like someone's gonna walk into my home i'm the only one here but anyways yeah this is a very precious secretive book and of course i have mang guarding it next thing is i want to show you guys two phone cases that i made just because they're so cute and i feel like these cases by themselves tell you my whole aesthetic and vibe so the first one is this one yes your girl did it so this one i did it in the bonobo cafe in hongdae i'll put it right here i have a vlog about this i think if i do i'll link it down below but yeah this one is the phone case i made which i am not like i'm happy with it but i'm not satisfied because i didn't end up picking enough rhinestones for a round and like to fill in and stuff but still it's really cute and obviously i went with like a color theme and this keychain thing i didn't get it there i bought it separately and i just put it in here but look how cute i need to go back again because i want to make another phone case and i also want to make an airpod case and a mirror so i need to go and when i go i'll try to make a better log so i can show you guys the cafe and everything because it's amazing so i have this phone case so cute and this other one this one's a bit more uh sim not simple it's just i just bought a clear case and i just bought stickers and these are all stickers um so the bad thing about it is that obviously stickers come out it's still so cute and this little pop socket i got it at the subway station and that's it so i basically just put all these stickers together and i kind of uh, I really want to create my own phone cases and stuff because this is like the kind of things i like but 
I gotta look into all the things. But anyways, these are two cute covers and designed by Jen. Next is my slippers, which I was just checking that they're not dirty. They're kind of dirty. Ew. But anyways, here they are. So I got this at no surprise Daiso and they're just the cutest things ever. So nothing really big to talk about it. They're just slippers but they're cute last thing i'm going to show in this video because i will be doing a part two later but the last thing i want to show you is my baby my son this little cute cute strawberry penguin that i did and um i'll put the name here if i found out what these things are called but they're basically diys like it's just a bunch of like what is this cotton i don't know and then you basically have to like get a needle and just form it so this took like two hours and a half at least two hours but anyways look how cute he is and i just wanted to show this because this is definitely one of the cutest things i own and with this i am going to end this video so i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and hope that the cute things i showed you brought a smile to your face or like made you just get inspired to get cute things or if you like cute things too let me know down below what kind of things like are you more into cute clothes cute jewelry cute stationery or just in general anything cute you see you grab like me then let me know and stay tuned because i do want to do a part two because i obviously do have more cute things and if you haven't followed me on instagram already make sure you go follow um because i post there daily and if usually if I buy something that's really cute, I like to post about it just to share to you guys about it and everything. And anyways, other than that, um, stay tuned for more videos. Hit subscribe. We're almost at 1,000, 1K, which is great. Yeah, and follow me on TikTok because lately I've been getting more into mini vlogs. So sometimes if I get lazy to do a video on YouTube, I just do mini vlogs on my TikTok. And I'm going to stop talking and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, adios.